All right, Gilly, well, yeah. it's time for some music now. Now, you would remember Mark Zanotti, who played for the West Coast Eagles. I remember and Fitzroy him very and well. Brisbane, and, of course, James Manson, a former and Collingwood James. Premiership player that also <laughs> played with Fitzroy. They've got their band on the show tonight. They're called the Fitzroy Gorillas. Please make them welcome. Yeah. Journey to the north. What preacher said, he said, yeah, I'm short the box of God, but hold these words instead. Golden reflecting my advice free. There's a trick to Christian values and it's compulsory. Stay frosty, that's what the preacher man said. Stay frosty. His words the racket in my head. You can't control your future, can't control your friends in a world without end. Stay frosty now. Hey, yeah. Stay frosty now. Ooh, right. Okay. So I traveled to the south and ancient rabbi appeared to me Voice heavy with the sands of time he made me see Same as Kabbalah did for you it's free God got us on a journey but be careful with those feet In a world without end like that ancient mortal said, don't want it to get you go, don't show them where it's hid. That's just what I did. Stay frosty. Whoa! Look out. Here we go. Twice you wanna be a monk, gotta cook a lot of rice. Stay frosty in a world without it. I'll stay frosty. Work hard at this, my friend. Look beyond that trunk, provide him. Got his love, but get it right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. And stay frosty now. All right, here we go. Take it, boys. Yours, Andy. To that Karatha coast where the folks know about frostiness, they frosty us the most. My brand new landlord proposed me a tone. My West Coast souls stay frosty, chanted like a mantra, stay frosty. There ain't nothing you can't handle. Far and wide, far as it's remote, trust in hell. But tie up your camel, yeah, 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 yeah. And stay frosty now. All right, take it on, boys. Guys, now, James, firstly to you, from fully-fledged fu fully AFL footballers to now fully-fledged musos, rock musicians. How did that come about? Oh, it's just something I probably always did all my life. Um, but actually, the, uh, the first time I ever played with that drummer, he was 11 and I was 14. <laughs> so it's just something you, 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 you do. Um, like, it was great to see the, the young guitar player there before. Just fantastic. <laughs> now, Mark, tell us about uh, how you became the singer of the band, because originally they didn't have you in the lineup, and then somehow you weaseled your way in. How'd that come about? Yeah, I was just jogging laps with James one night, <laughs> and uh, the singer had pulled out, and they had to do a police and fireman's game, the World Games, the opening, and uh, about 60,000, 70,000 people there, and you needed a singer, and I said I'd do it, and... Took me about two weeks to convince him. He said, oh, you may as well give it a go, mate. I've got no-one else. What a great first-up gig, <laughs> 60,000 people. Now, James, you played at two AFL clubs. Of course, you played in the Collingwood 1990 Premiership team and you also played at Fitzroy. How would you enjoy your time at both clubs? Oh, it was, it was uh, pretty uh, different uh, going to Fitzroy from Collingwood. Um, even back in those days, the professionalism of Collingwood, um, you know, and then you go to Fitzroy and... Um, 
you know, turning up to training and the gates were padlocked. Uh, you couldn't even get into to the Lakeside Oval and things like that because they hadn't paid their, their council rates and things like that. But um, I just loved it. I loved blo both clubs, loved all the blokes, and, yeah, it was magic. Awesome. Now, Mark, you copped a fair bit when you were playing. People seemed to go for you every week. What, what was going on there? Why did that happen oh, to you? I then? suppose they were just trying to square up, but I give them <laughs> ten minutes before, I guess. <laughs> Not much more than that. But, yeah, it was pretty, pretty hard days in those days. And, uh, actually, it's funny, me... Um, <laughs> My daughter plays now AFL for, um, for uh, Palm Beach Corumba, so all the girls down there, good luck, but good hairstyle, eh? eh? <laughs> now, when's your next gig on, James? I'm not sure, mate. Uh, we normally do a gig once every every uh, month or so. The problem is our lead singer's uh, driving a crane in the mines uh, <laughs> over in WA, so he gets over to Melbourne uh, once a month and uh, we get out there and do a few gigs, so, yeah. Oh, awesome. Well, the good thing is, folks, that they'll be back to close the show later on. Put your hands together once more for the Fitzroy Gorillas. <laughs>